I'm going to One Ok, One ok Rock Live here in Tokyo at Tokyo Dome tonight. I'm so excited because this is their home country and the atmosphere is going to be amazing. So let's go along, see what our concert here is like. Today I'm here with my friends, Shota, Aaron, and Taise. It's a lot of fun. Everyone It's only 4 o'clock right now, but there's already a lot of people. We still have two hours before going inside. Um, it's so exciting because there's so many fans around and I feel like I've never been at this kind of like atmosphere where there's like thousands and thousands of, of like people who are fans of the same band as you and everyone's just like ah. Yeah, Taise is the one who got the tickets for us, so Arigato Taise. So they were just selling binoculars. Hope we don't get a seat where we need binoculars because that means they're going to be so freaking far away. But is that a Japanese thing? I don't feel like I've ever seen that before. Next to Tokyo Dome Stadium, they have like a theme park and I've never actually been here before, but there's a massive roller coaster. So if you ever have a live concert, you may as well go next door, spend the day there and then come here in the evening. There's also a lot of shops around the stadium. So they have gates and in between those gates, they've got like a baseball shop, they've got Taco Bell. There's so much around here. So this is very different to Australia. I feel like our only stadium has like food outlets and that's it. So you wouldn't get here this early, but I kind of regret not getting here at like midday and then just spending the whole day here. I'm kind of looking forward to seeing what a concert is like in Japan because it must be really organized because it's Japanese, right? Basically in Japan, at least for this concert, we don't know where we're sitting. We all paid the same price, which was Ichiman Seiyan on it. Basically told the day before the concert that we're sitting in this gate or this row. And we were like, we'll be fun if we didn't know where we're going to be. So it's literally like less than two hours before we're going in and we don't know where we are. It'll be interesting. It'll be very interesting. So we're going to find out if we're going to be at the very back or the very front. Anywhere we're going to be, we're going to have a good time. Try and get your merch online first because we were able to order online. The merch is also apparently the same. It looks very similar. That line is massive. It's like Disneyland levels. It goes so far. The shop is like over there. Taise is actually like the biggest one on K rock fan that I know. Yeah. Like such a big two. fan. How many concerts have you been to so far? Uh, I went to three concerts. Nah. Or four. Yeah, yeah. He's been listening to it since you're like a young teenager, right? Yeah. How did you get the tickets? One o'clock on the website. Then I'm going to get the tickets. 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 This is my first time here. I feel like I should come here and explore it more. Okay, we're on our way to eat. Hopefully, it's not too busy. Because everything towards the dome is like packed. This is the merch. I got this shirt for about, I think it was 4,000 yen or 3,600. And it's pretty simple and cute. It's oversized. This is an XL though. I know, it's not really an XL. Um, it comes sure. down to about here. The band. Yeah, the band is really cute. I think it's perfect for the live. And this was only 500 yen, so like less than $5. Perfect. Anyway, we've lost everyone. Gotta go. So these guys are trying to figure out who the <laughs> opening act is going to be because at a lot of one of their openings they have yes ne? and they think it's going to be simple plan yeah. because they just had a live concert a week ago here and like we're looking at their socials. Aaron's really dedicated to this. <laughs> <laughs> they did a collaboration with Taka for Time of Paradise. So if they come, I would want them to collab mm. and sing that song because I love that song. Mm. Ne ne it's really good. I got a margarita pizza and it came out really fast, so good job. After eating, the line that was here for the merch is like almost completely gone. Uh, it might be down the other end. So we're gonna go check out if there's any merch that wasn't available online in advance. And they already run out of water. I was planning to buy my water from one of those vending machines and it's all sold out. They only have like Coke and like tea. You may dance. But you may dance. The time has come to figure out where we're sitting. About 30 minutes to go before we're inside. Honestly, getting the ticket on our like apps and our phones was the biggest pain in the ass. It took like two hours today. We have it all on our phones on this Japanese app, and we're trying to figure out where our seats are. Because at Tokyo Dome, you don't standing. I think you can stand up, but everyone has a seat, so there's no like mosh pit. So even though we don't know where we're sitting, we're all guaranteed to be together. That's how the system works. So even though we're all paying about $100 each, we could be at the very back, the very front, 
Just so short this idea. He's like, guys, you can't look for the longest time. <laughs> look at him. なんで、マシタカタンですか?せっかく行くんだったら楽しみを増やしたかったからです。そうだね。そうです。で、この2人がめっちゃ東京ドームどんな感じかチェックしてるところです。The <笑> moment of truth. せーの。we don't, don't know. It's the vibe. <laughs> we weren't really sure what our seats meant, so we'll just have to find out when we get inside. First, we had to go through a security check. They scanned our ticket with this digital stamp, essentially, and then we were inside where they handed us these mysterious bands. We were just given a like light, and apparently it'll only turn on at the right time. So I turned it on, and it was like flashing blue for a second. So that's really cool. That's definitely not like a thing overseas. It. it was super packed inside and there was surprisingly a lot of food for sale but I wanted to head to the seat because I couldn't wait to see what our view would be like and it looked like this. We just got to our seats and I'm pretty happy with the view. I feel like considering how much variety there is inside this massive dome stadium, it's pretty decent. We're kind of like on the right hand side but when they come onto the stage to perform, We'll definitely be able to see them. It's very interesting though because there's like everyone has a seat here, even on the like standing area, which would be the mosh. The good thing is it's like all very, very fair because even though we're all paying the same price, you don't know where you end up. We believe we're not allowed to film during the performance, and I think I prefer that because then you're really enjoying the moment and you're not just focused on getting a photo or filming it. One thing I've noticed though, just sitting here while waiting, is there's so many smells of food. And I feel like if you went to a concert anywhere else overseas, there would not be food. And people are drinking beer. There's like a lady, she goes around like bringing out beer. It's like, it's basically like a baseball game. I don't know, it feels really weird. It feels like I'm about to watch a movie or like a performance and not go for like a live concert for a rock band. It's quite bizarre. I guess it's special because it's Tokyo Dome. Just finished the main live bit and we're waiting for the encore and this is apparently when you can bring your phone out everyone's just like flashing their light like sure that is <laughs> and everyone's trying to sing the lyrics well like not the lyrics but like hum the song that they want them to play kind of cute we'll see what happens The show was so freaking amazing. When we walked out, we got a free bottle of Monster because they're sponsoring the event and the wind was so crazy leaving the stadium. I'd heard that before, but it was wild. We just finished the live concert and it was amazing. Had the best time. Did you guys have fun? Yeah, it was yeah. amazing. Awesome. And they sang like a lot of the old songs. Like they sang the beginning. What else did they sing, guys? We are. Like a lot from Ambition. Anyway, it was a really awesome time. We're going to go home now. And I can't wait to go back to another concert. And hopefully in summer we'll go see them. Arigato! Bye!